what is up YouTube? It is your boy Zach Tactical coming back at you again with another video. And, well, we played uh, a little bit last time we got on Mech Warrior, and uh, well, the new DLC came out. DLC 4, Rise of Razzle Hag, Razzle Hag, however you pronounce it. You guys love correcting my grammar. Well, uh, it may or may not have corrupted my entire save with all the mods that I had, and it got rid of all my stuff. So I had to start on a fresh save in the past two weeks. Um, I've been busy these past two weeks, man. I have been moving. If you guys didn't know, I was moving to a different army base. And uh, that was a whole deal. That was a whole deal. Through the rain and snow, we finally made it. We got here. As you can see, all the boxes and stuff behind me. Um, it was stressful, but we got it done. I have been getting a little bit into Battletech, the tabletop, recently. And I have been working on very uh, amateurly painting my own battle mechs and I wanted to show off this little mad dog that I got let me see if it'll focus on it I, I'm not great at painting you know I'm getting better you know we're getting there but I wanted to paint it something from you know the playthrough we're doing so the black and orange paint is what we've been using recently it's not great but you know it's honest work that being said I'll give you guys a tour of the 20 or of the uh, 3038 new uh, mech lab that I've got going on. Uh, restart of my entire campaign. So as you see, we've installed some mods that are DLC4 compatible. Um, so obviously the Timberwolf Prime, uh, Mad Dog Prime, Hellbringer Prime, and the Marauder uh, Classic are all available on the Steam Workshop now in a collection, and they are yet another mech lab compatible and standalone. Uh, there is also another mod that the guy added. Oh, forgot to mention the summoner down there as well. There's also another mod he added. Uh, I want to say it's the Hell, yeah, the Hellhound, which is a Mech Warrior 4 mech, which is a I think it's a relatively quick to buy and quick to get Mech Warrior 4 uh, mech that you can play, and it was a really cool mech that I'm a little nostalgic about. And hopefully we can run into one of those, maybe even in the playthrough. I don't know what year he decided, the mod creator decided to start introducing them, but I've managed uh, in the, I think it's like 10 years in game time to get every one of his mechs except for that brand new one that just dropped. Um, so we're hoping that we get to it. Uh, so the current loadout is those five mechs that I just said. We've got a Marauder 3 Delta. Um, I've kitted it out with some clan stuff that I had left over from my last save that was, thank God, able to port over. Basically just a ER, bunch of bunch of ER medium lasers um, and an ER large laser. Nothing too crazy, but it's a it's a workhorse. We've got two black knights. Uh, one of those has a PPC on it for sure, and then the rest are all <laughs> uh, clan heavy large lasers, and it packs a punch. Uh, and then we have the black knight six KNT or BL six KNT. Basically just a bunch of medium lasers, large lasers, smorgasbord work of stuff with a PPC on top. I think it even might have a small laser on there somewhere. Might be the other build. But yeah, we kitted it out pretty well. Uh, I actually managed to find the hero variant of the, uh, oh God, I'm completely forgetting what this one was called, the Mackie. Uh, so we found the hero variant, which has the, it's like the Kilroy hero variant. Basically it's a beast and I did not change anything from the uh, vanilla, you know, loadout configuration that it comes with it. Uh, it comes with uh, two PPCs, two LB10 CLU cluster, I assume that is, and two medium lasers, and it packs a punch. And I found out through yet another mech lab, you can also change whether the LB10Xs do cluster or solid uh, groupings, which is really badass because it basically just turns it into like an AC10. Uh, I think with some more damage, you'll have to excuse me. I'm still getting used to the statistics of it. It does have a poor performance quirk and an obsolete quirk but we're gonna skip over that. I like it, so I'm gonna keep it. Uh, Phoenix Hawk, so with the new Rise of Rise of Hag DLC comes the infiltration missions. And I found a pretty easy way to cheese those where you just put a Leopard C3 link where you can see pretty much everything on the battlefield and target it with your sensors pretty quickly, uh, which half of those missions just require you to lock on to a mech, get a sensor lock and then dip out of there. And then I also put a stealth suit on it from yet another clan. Uh, and it basically <laughs> it basically makes you invisible. And uh, playing through some of those, the mechs just do not want to shoot you. Now you can still set off the uh, the alarms pretty quickly if you're near them within 100 meters. Uh, but I've managed to get pretty damn close. And uh, 
and nobody saw anything. Nobody saw the you know the giant 45 ton mech running around their base. So kudos kudos to that build. And then lastly, I got a uh, Wolverine 7 Hotel from uh, I think it actually came with yet another mech lab or one of the mods that I have, and it's just a free mech you can get on the planet of Valentine. It's in uh, Karita space. Uh, I just went over there to the house, the uh, planet of Valentine and it just was there for free. Got a thing from uh, uh, the XO and she was like, hey, here's this free mech. And I was like, cool, no problem. Have I personally used it in any of the missions? No, I'm not a big fan of the Wolverine. Also, Inner Spear, ew, Rebirth, scum. Uh, but at the same time, I appreciate free mechs where I can get them. Uh, but that being said, you guys will see the loadouts. I haven't had much time to customize the uh, Timberwolf Mad Dog. I've had decent builds. I'm a big fan of the Mad Dog, which is what I'm going to be using today. Um, I've got two SRM6 slash twos. Basically, it's just two volleys of SRM6s, and then two of those with two Snubnose PPCs. Um, and I believe I might have two small X Pulse lasers on there just to throw it in for some extra damage when heat gets pretty hot. Uh, and Contrary to popular belief, heat is hot. But uh, that being said, melting my cockpit aside, it's a really good build. It's not a standard build for a uh, Mad Dog, because I know they're supposed to be kind of like a support mech or a striker blend, but uh, I like getting close and personal, and those Snubnose PPCs also allow me to get a little bit of standoff. It's a couple hundred meters distance. It's definitely not the same range as an ER PPC, but uh, I still like using it. I like shooting lightning at people, so it's really fun. But anyway, we are going to go ahead and get into a couple of these missions. Now, we left off with the House Davion quest, Bring Her Home, which I do have unlocked, but I think we're gonna change it up a little bit. As you see right here, we're still on like the first part of it. So I think we are currently level 10 reputation. We're gonna move down to, I think, hmm. I think we're gonna try Hazing of the Week. I haven't actually done that one in any of my playthroughs, actually. So we're gonna view this system all the way over here in Liao space. Let's start making our way over there. It's going to be quite a journey. Also, if you don't know, I uh, downloaded a mod to change the camo pattern of the Leopard. Just because I wanted to. And I think the M81 1980s Army camo is badass. A transmission from somebody. Which is another quest. Okay, we'll get to that one on the way. Alright. So, campaign mission. We're going to have a targeted kill contract and a multiple mission operation. Let's hit that up. And with the amount of mechs I have right now, and how good they are, we can probably do a decent uh, multiple mission operation. I'm pretty happy with that. All right, where is this campaign mission? Oh, it switched it up on me. It keeps doing that, I don't know why. I'm gonna track hazing of the week, view the system. We are currently there. Let's go ahead and hit hazing of the week part one. A member of our church has decided to go rogue and kill settlers. This cannot stand. Defend the surviving settlers from the attacking scavengers while finding out information on the heretic. I don't know much about Liao, but I didn't know they were like a, like a religion thing. That's kind of odd. Cool. We'll learn about it. Hey, my nose any deep house Liao Lora. Always Commander. game to learn. Your visibility will be compromised out there. All right, we're gonna get that mad dog once again over tonnage by a little bit with two assault mechs. Let's try to chip that down a little bit. Let's bring out that Marauder Classic. Still over tonnage, okay. Get rid of that assault. And, oh man, do I have anything smaller? Yeah. Let's see. All right, we'll bring the summoner. So we need to drop 10 pounds. So over here, this one's 75. We can probably drop this and bring the Wolverine to we're gonna have 10 left over. I'm fine with that. So we got Guardian ECM on this summoner, which is good. We got some medium to long range work with the Marauder. It's got a heavy gauss on there that's dangerous. Wolverine 2, like I said, nothing special. Medium range brawler. Not Mad Dog Prime. Medium, schmedium range brawler, I think. I enjoy schmedium range. Okay. Straight into the mission, okay. All right, Commander. The will of Carly believes this location will be the next target of their rogue heretics. They want us to put these zealots down in order to shield their existence from the general public. Ah, 
so it's a defense mission. Awesome. Base health. Oh, I hate these. Let's send the Marine, the Marauder over there, and then I'll keep that summoner walking around with me. Should be able to match my speed. Urban mech? Why are we scared of an urban mech? I'm literally god compared to an urban mech. Looks like they're already getting some helicopters. Take those out. I know you guys can. Good god. It's already gonna be a problem. I'm gonna hit this urban mech. You guys, please don't be total duds. Actually do something, please. We're gonna hit this urban mech with this one-two punch of these SRMs commander. and it's gonna get bad. Already done. AC-20, gone. Absolutely destroyed. Now, I don't know if that was like a min-max build, but that guy was absolute trash. Get out of here. Alright, so we're pretty heavy on the west side. I'm gonna try to get this summoner over here to follow me. Take out that Vulcan ASAP. Identified. Hopefully this Wolverine can hold his own over here while we do work. Target acquired. Try to take out this harasser. Oh my god, I'm whipping shots. There we go. You're done. That's a rear shot. You're done. These SRMs, I don't know if they're just that overpowered or what, but good god. They made me happy. Oh. Oh, come on, buddy. Don't be getting in my base. I don't like that. There we go. Let's turn off that torso lock. And let's get that summoner right here. We're going to have the summoner just chill right on this side. I think we'll be able to make it just fine. I really hate that I had to get rid of my uh, glass in the cockpit mod. I was really big on that. It was pretty immersive. But uh, DLC 4 screwed up a lot of those mods. Alright, now we should be able to take these guys. Let's see here. We got a Locust, Easy Money, Cicada, Easy Money, and just a bunch of tanks it seems. Maybe some helicopters? No, harassers. Far away shot. PPCs aren't even gonna make it. We've got up to 540 range on these PPCs. It'd be hard to hit this thing. He's a moving target, but we hit him. PPCs. Let's hit him. Might as well hit him with a double. And you're done. Okay, it looks like he's going down. Wolverine's holding his own. I'll give him a little help. Oh yeah, he just gets circled by this cicada right now. Good for a kill shot. Oh, too close to the town. I don't like it. Get away from the town. There we go. There we go. There we go. Take out that leg. Might have killed somebody in the town, but you know, hey. Sorry about it. Get good. These rocks are going to be the bane of my existence. I think these stub noses do not 100% line up with the cursor or the reticle uh, every shot. I'm not making excuses, but I, I have noticed they hit a little low. So I have to compensate for that every time I'm shooting with this. But hey, I'm cool with being in the Mad Dog either way. Now hopefully this summoner's getting some more. I'm trying to space out the jobs, you know? Target acquired. Let's go hunt. Alright, hunchback, we can take that easy. Stay away from that AC-20. We're going to give him a couple of volleys of SRMs. There we go. Don't hit me with that. Ooh, Target. I think that was a miss. Torso's gone, and we can just pick him off now. Alright, we gotta switch the small lasers. Should be fun. Ooh, 
Ooh. Lagged out for a second there. It's always a good note when the game lags because you just killed them so hard. I like that. Vulcan, close range brawler, and Locust. God. I, I honestly I think these some of these light mechs these builds only exist to just give you easy targets in missions because good like what is this guy gonna do? Now he could fuck up these town this town pretty easily, so that's something I am worried about. Let's try to take him out real quick. And you're done. Vulcan, let's get his ass before he starts hitting one of the AI. Let's go for a leg. Legs are tough. Okay. There we go. Right leg, gimme, gimme, gimme. Come on. There we go. He lives to fight another day. Probably hit that guy from here. Don't worry about it. Got a spider. It's only light mechs coming my way. I feel like uh, they need to send some damn assault mechs my way. I need some salvage. Got to rip the meat, save the metal. What are the what do they fucking say? Uh, there's like one pilot out of uh, Kestrel Lancers, and she died in one of my playthroughs. But uh, just absolute sounds like a raider from Fallout. Some of the voice lines I heard, and it was like motivating. <laughs> rip the meat, save the fle uh, save the salvage. Hitting this guy is not too far away. Hopefully that uh, summoner can take him. Oh yeah, he's about leg. Summoner can take him easy. We'll go for him, but I think we're not going to catch up in time. We're well over halfway done with this defense. Out what that little Wi-Fi signal up there means. After like 100 hours in this game, I still don't know what that little Wi-Fi signal next to it means. Maybe like someone's got a lock on him. I'm I'm not sure. I'm trying to aim these damn PPCs. I'm actually trash. That was a headshot though. All right, come on. You're done. Too easy. Destroyed. Ten more, no, nine more, and we're done. We're, we're still at 93 on this garrison. We are money. Absolutely money. Where are they at? I think they all ran off, guys. I think they're too scared. Additional Never mind. Just cross the perimeter, Commander. Expect company soon. Please tell me it's at least like an assault lance just dropping right on top of me. A lot of, uh, that's a lot of LRMs. Who's that? Wolverine's getting, no, he's fine. Cicadas, again. Oh, but we do have three mechs. Catapult, I want that. All right, we're gonna leave these guys to deal with them. I think the lance should be fine without me. It should be. Apparently, uh, Piranha updated the game and uh, made the lances more uh, smarterer. So we will see if uh, they're uh, smarterer. damage enough. I want you. Come here. Give me your legs. I demand your legs. That's what I thought. And that's what I thought. That's going to be a good uh, salvage right there. I think I have enough negotiation points for decent salvage on that. Come on, give me that leg. Heat's pretty bad, but that left leg is toast. That's what I thought. And who do we got left? Locust, once again! Two machine guns and a medium laser. Guy, like, just run away or eject now. I'll give you the chance. This is hardly fair. Just hit the eject button. Go ahead, I'll give you a chance. Never mind. Wolverine had... Wolverine was out for blood. Alright. Give me 
assault lance. Watch out. Man, I got a I get this mod called War FX, and it is just insane the amount of like smoldering wreck you can have on these defense missions. Good God, because it keeps them burning for a lot longer. All right, I got a fire starter. Okay, take that out easy. Uh, let's get this helicopter first. Oh, PPC? Nope. Nope. All right, that's I'm not I'm not meant for that. I'm not that guy. I'm not even gonna try. I'm not even gonna try. Ways to get heat. Summoner, how you doing? Ah, uh, leg could be better. Hunchback. Oh yeah, we're just gonna keep pummeling them. Once I close the distance with these SRMs, it's over. Goodbye, right torso. At this point, I'm not even worried about him. Let's just get this J. Edgar. Beat me to the punch. Oh, is he? Oh, damn, he shut down. He overheat himself? Interesting. Try to snipe this thing. Ah, he beat me to the punch. Last two, I think we can almost condense down. Ooh, that's not good. Locust is tearing up the city. Looks like he's in the middle of it. Let him slip by. Alright, let me try to find him real quick. Try to minimize collateral damage here, but, uh... Probably not gonna happen. Alright, come here. Oh god, we're not minimizing shit. Sorry. Sorry, you worked really hard on this business. I'm sorry to destroy the entire thing. Alright, we're just gonna get out of the city. <laughs> I'm gonna let the entire lance worry about that guy. I'm not gonna be the one to sign that, uh, that IOU. Doing a lot of property damage here. Like I'm gonna fucking kill dozer. Okay, we got one more mech out this way, I think, and we should be good. Fire starter. Damn, he just ran away. He's smart, but uh, I don't think he's that smart because he's not ejected yet. But we'll give him the chance. I don't know why he just ran away the entire time. But he's got an entire, like, heavy lance coming towards his ass right now. I don't know what the game plan for this guy is. He's the last enemy. So we can leave that base just fine. Hello. We're just going to hit one volley, two volley, and I'm not even going to give you the SRM, so I'll give you a chance to eject. Or not. Wolverine is out for blood today. Good God, guy. I don't know who you are or what brought you to our settlement, but on behalf of my people, thank you for saving us. Not bad. Nice work here, Commander. See you back aboard the ship. Let's see if I can get that catapult, because I would like, I would like a catapult. Trying to, I have never seen a hero variant of a catapult. Um, I'd like to get one of those one day. Got to get me one of those. Waiting. There we go. Okay. Catapult. Perfect. Ah! If only we had more points. So, we can get a cicada. We do need one of those. Uh, I didn't see anything that, that interesting I really wanted. So, let's hit a cicada here because we need to turn that one in. And then, anything with an engine left? Not. Nope. Nope, no engines. Okay, so we'll just take some AC-5s and some LRM-10s. Let's finish up with just a bunch of medium lasers. Good salvage. Decent salvage. Everybody's healthy. Fairly little damage. This is too easy. The job rewards, collect one cicada. Perfect. Okay, 
Here you go. You can have that for free. Too easy. Okay. So, let's see. It wants us to do the second level of this campaign mission. But you know what I want to do? I want to... I want a harder mission because this is just too easy. I got to get some content on the damn YouTube. So we're going to try to find a harder mission. Where can we go for a harder mission? 11 to 12. And who do we got here? Crater Cobras. Mech level medium. I don't mind taking on the Crater Cobras. That sounds like an easy job. Uh, let's just repair all because we're rich and I don't care about an up cost, up charge. We're going to go kill some stuff over here. I'm going to try to go straight into some... Ooh, what about these guys? Regs, long striders. Now nah, we're going for the Crater Cobras. We're going to go hunt some mercenaries. And if you guys don't know, with the rise of Razzle Hag, uh, Hag, I keep correcting myself, uh, the Bounty Hunter, the infamous character in Battletech lore that has existed for hundreds, hundreds of years, um is a thing and I got a message from him right after I finished the main campaign and uh, basically he gives you extra money and rewards for taking out mercenary companies and if you don't know mercenary companies can either assist you which I've never seen or basically they drop into missions where you're doing something against a faction they're allied with and they get contracted to come in and kill you now it so far hasn't thrown a kink in any of my missions they've been like level 10 to level 7 missions I fought the Wolf Dragoons, and I think the Grey Death Legion, and uh, it does have a little really cool like lore snippet that tells you about the Wolf Dragoons, which is really awesome, and, and well, just any mercenary company. Um, but yeah, they dropped in, it's like one lance in the very beginning, I toast them, because we're not ass at the game, I think, and uh, it doesn't affect much in the mission. So I was thinking it'd be a lot harder, but maybe it's only hard in like an early playthrough, I'm not sure. Let's see what kind of contracts we got here. Oh, that's Battle Mix. Got a multiple mission. Yeah, let's do the uh, let's do the multiple mission. I like the multiple mission operations because it actually challenges me to use different mechs as we go. I can't just prepare and keep going. All right. Three mission operation against Independence, Extreme Smoke, Hot Sulfur. Okay. We're conducting an intelligence gathering raid on High, uh, high Sphere High. Sp I Spire 1. And to draw attention away from our actions, we need a diversion, destroying yada yada yada. They're going to try to kill me. Okay, that's easy. Alright, this one's going to be Scorched Earth. Okay, oh, we have an infiltration one, so you guys can possibly see that one if we get there. Let's go ahead and max out Salvage. Salvage just rules the day every time. Uh, okay, so we're doing Scorched Earth. We've got a lot of tonnage to work with, so let's go ahead and show off another mech. I want to show you guys. Hmm. Show you guys the Hellbringer. Things badass, man. And let's bring in both of our Black Knights, the twins, as I affectionately call them. And then I think we can keep that summoner right there. No problem with me. Okay. Oh, we got almost twins, cousins, and then twins. I'll take it. I never really got the uh, tactical difference between the summoner and the Hellbringer. As the Thor and the Loki for some of you Inner Sphere cats out there. Uh, I'm still kind of learning it. Uh, honestly, so far, the Hellbringer seems like it can have more fire support, and the Summoner seems like it's more of a sensor type mech, a little bit less armaments. I may be wrong, maybe completely wrong, but so far, that's what it seems like. Uh, one really unique build, um, I haven't found it yet, but I know the Black Knight clan buster variant that was released uh, during the clan invasion i think towards the end towards two kid um it is a badass variant that i know is in the game because i looked it up um and it's basically a close range brawler and i want to say it's got a melee weapon or at least one of the variants has a melee weapon but i want to say it's that one and it's fucking terrifying oh shit okay it's perfect mercenaries coming in you guys get to see it side by side no one can stop us Let's go. Oh, side by side. Our target is the central Okay, so we're working around. with we are being paid the co the crater covers. Oh, okay. Let's see what they look like. I wonder if the paint we job is any different. If you have to. But this target is too valuable for the enemy to ignore for long. Not bad, not bad. They got a crusader. What's the paint job? White 
and kind of like a grayish black, and they're just following me around. Okay, I'll take it. I haven't, okay. <laughs> like I said, I haven't, I haven't done a mission where I work with uh, the mercenaries, so that's interesting. I don't know how that affects anything, but we'll see. If you guys didn't see the uh, Hellbringers loadouts, ER large laser, PPC, machine guns, and MRM-40, which is inside. chef's kiss, amazing. And two small lasers. Actually, three small lasers, correction. I have those firing all in conjunction with the machine guns, because you might as well. And it's just easy, easy money. Now, I'm going to send these guys straight into the base before we trigger anything. I want to actually get the AI to do some work in these, because I think a lot of these missions, you know, you as the commander do all the work. And AI kind of just is there. So I want to get these guys to actually push forward and uh, put some work in. How is this guy? Is he already damaged? We just started! Okay. Alright, so we got the summoner over there. And our Black Knights are moving in. I'm gonna move in at, if you press G, you can move in at your lance speed, which is like your overall max speed for the lance, which I actually really like a lot. And it's also kind of like a cruise control. And we're just gonna tear this guy up from here. Marauder Classic has no armaments. I'll know what happened there. Alright, we're gonna get out of cruise control mode. Now, my heat management on this one is not great. Not bueno. But I think we're gonna have some fun with the MRMs. Oh, yeah. We're just gonna take out the stuff right here. I think we're just gonna switch to the MRMs in short range. Um, I like sticking to those because, like, the heat manage management's pretty bad right now for me. But uh, if I just use the MRMs in conjunction with the machine guns and small lasers, I can just do this all day if I do it right. Crusader is Benito. Ooh. Oh, he's got oh, he's got flamers. That's not good. I didn't even notice the guy had flamers. I thought he was just dying. Oh, and he ejected. That's what you get, bitch. These tanks are scary indeed. Target destroyed. Target we got left. Acquired. That Marauder Classic. I don't. I don't know what happened with the Marauder uh, Classic, but uh, he's kind of just vibing over there with no weapons. So I'm just gonna let him exist. I think. Oh, we gotta destroy the base. Yeah. I think we can do that pretty easy. Walk around, smash some stuff, and get out of it. Whoa, that was badass. The fuel just exploded. Hell yeah. I've never seen that before. Good to see the AI is actually shooting at stuff now. I haven't seen that before. Good sound. Pull up some fuel tanks. Be done now. New objective. That's it. All right, we'll be out of here. Let's deal later. Best get to the evac point now before more reinforcements arrive. I really want that Marauder Classic. Like I already have one, but you know what? I'm, I'm gonna let him live. Just have a sign of respect. Oh, we gotta go for supplies. Sorry, but we're, we're going for these. You guys can wait for now. LRMs can wait. It doesn't even phase me at this point. It doesn't even phase me. I'll let that guy live. And we're out of here. Okay. I like how at the end of the missions, they just, like, stop doing anything. It's always fun. 
just to see him just stop in their tracks. They're like, oh, he's leaving. Never mind. Stop shooting him. We're good. Ranked up a little bit with the rival stuff. Counter the crater cobras. Probably going to get a message about that, and they're going to tell me about him, which is kind of cool. Uh, we do have two Crusader variants, and I did just get done trash-talking them. But I see six missile slots. Hmm. I think we're going to take that. And we got about 14, so we're actually going to get two of them. Not bad. Not bad at all. So one of three missions. Let's go ahead and knock these out. Uh, this one should be... Pick a fight. What is the actual mission? Hello? Can you tell me what the mission is? View contract. Well, fuck it. We're just going to fall out with what we've got. I think we can keep these Black Knights in the fight. Uh, summoner... We're gonna, you know what? We're gonna keep everybody in the fight. I'm not gonna change it up. I'm gonna be ballsy with this one. But uh, the next one's an infiltration mission, so all we gotta do is survive this one. Hopefully, not lose very many clan weapons, because as the year is 3038, it might be kind of hard to find those. For don't tell anybody if I won't. You know, if you don't tell anybody, I won't tell anybody. But uh, we snuck some clan stuff into Rise of Rizelhag, and it was. Uh, Reactor mint. online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Okay. Enemy God damn that brightness. Over on this area. Reach checkpoint but out to set up your hold. Okay. Holding them back for as long as possible. We have but substantial black combat up here. bonus opportunities the longer you can hold them off. But be sure not to overextend yourself. If we keep both these black knights right here, should cover that very open danger area right there. Uh, oh, damn. I'm scorched. We should be good to move over Enemy here with the summoner. It looks like I've got a big hill right there, so I'm going to I'm gonna use that hill for sure. Got some friendly infantry over here. I love the infantry mod, man. They, it makes me think they're going to help, but uh, I'm pretty sure they don't do any, any real damage, aside from, like, tickle you. You'd love to see I'm it. Going to cook that incoming mech pilot in their cockpit. Oh, okay. I like to hear it. On the move. Try to move over there and get them. On mark at waypoint. Right behind you. Black Knights can definitely handle that Wolverine right there. On the move. Target yeah, acquired. they can handle that on their own, I think. I'm not going to tell them who to attack because that resets all of their waypoints and orders, so I'm just going to let them ball out. Location, Commander. Luckily, we don't have to protect anything. We're just here to kill stuff, which I always like Target. to see. Acquired. Let's take out who's the next target. Oh, headshot. Let's get another one. My Wolverine should be going down. Oh, there we go. Looks like he tripped and fell. Let's switch his ECM to disrupt. If I'm right, that should keep their rockets from being able to hit us better, I'm pretty sure. Enemy mech oh yeah, you're done. Oh, and we overheated. Rookie mistake, but I think it was worth it. He is... Come on, he's dead right here. Come on. You're dead. Torso is mine. Enemy, That's down. what I thought. Both torsos gone. Destroyed. Mech gone. Target Except they all acquired. dropped over there. I'm gonna have both those black knights Coming hit that grasshopper. Okay, go ahead and displace over here. Try to get these guys up on the acquired. ridge line. Can we hit him? He's hurt, but he's not dead. PPC finish him off, it Enemy does. That's what I like. Good shot. Me. 
think this Black Knights have got the Grasshopper, no problem. I'll take this Partisan right here. And that's a flub. Well, you get some, you win some, you lose some. Try to give him some help from over here. I like this build. It's a pretty good overall, every range brawler. I think that might actually be one of the strengths of the Hellbringer that I did read about, is that you can do pretty much every uh, every range with it if you kit it out right. Target acquired. All right, Black Knights, are we going to do anything here? Copy that on your target. Warning, warning. Right, Shutdown sequence crit. He's done. imminent. Watch your step. That mech is about to pop. All right, I hit the partisan. Target acquired. On my way. Come on, he's peeking right over the top. Let's Target get him. There we go. Done. I don't know what uh, a summoner down there is doing, but we're gonna let him vibe. As long as he's giving me ECM coverage, which he's not. Get over here. Oh, I think I might have told him to not shoot. Toggle well, you see a mode counter. Oh, oh, we never did it originally. Okay. Now he's countering their ECMs. They got those. Target down. Target destroyed. Whitworth. Okay, part of the clan mod. Piece of shit, Meg. Additional contacts just cross the perimeter, Commander. Expect there we company go. soon. Destroyed. Light mech? What is that? A commando? Enemy mech. Commando. Okay. Okay. We're gonna just start stripping that armor all the way from back here. He wants to keep coming towards us with that that devastating one large laser and SRM six. He can. But uh, I think we might uh, we might beat him to the punch. That's a lance. Acquired. Enemy mech detected. Try to keep that commando off their backs. Warning. As you know, that can go very bad. Imminent. Mech scrapped. I think the Black Knights can handle themselves. Ah! Alright, I'm gonna get in the fight. Oh, legs going crit. Leg is not doing good. Yeah, calm down, you'll be fun. They got this horny toad. Okay, we're gonna go for the legs now because I haven't seen this horny toad before. What the hell mech is this? It's like a crab atlas fate? What the hell is that? We're trying to leg that one. Cockpit is rumbling from the machine gun fire. Come here. Give me your legs. I want them. Yeah, it's got an Atlas face and it's like a crab body. That is fucking terrifying. Horny Toad. Any supplies? No. I wish I could tell the Black Knight to eject because they don't need to do anything anymore. I, wish that, I really do wish there was like a control to tell the uh, other pilots to eject. Let's try to keep this Black Knight here. Let's keep them over here for long range support. Summoner is alone and unafraid. Oh, they drop off. A lot of shit. Stalker, not good. Got a lot of LRM, so I'm gonna try to close the gap. Hammer hands, two AC-10s, medium lasers, we can handle that. Oh, oh, oh! All right, this is gonna be a fight right here. Good, this is what I like. Warning. Use Warning. the buildings as cover. All right, Summoner, any help right now would be greatly appreciated. I'm gonna push them. Stalkers right here, I'm gonna get the ass.
right in the rear torso. Give me that side torso. Might be able to get a melee. Hold on. Yeah. There we go. Like to see it. Oh, lots of medium lasers hitting me. Not good. Let's get that blackjack out of here. Hammer hands is shut down. Hit him in the rear. Alright, he's ejected. And blackjack's up on the hill. He's still full up. We're gonna need everybody to get that guy. I don't like the fact that he's still got those lasers. Not anymore. Alright, 16 out of 16, baby. Ooh, that's bright. Love to see it. Give me some good salvage. Let's get the fuck out of here. Another completely broken Marauder Classic. He's coming in the fight, baby. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let that guy. I think it's the same guy from the last mission. <laughs> hey guys, I'm here. Oh, come on, guys, let him live. But I'm not gonna stop you. You get the kill before we get out of here. That's, uh, that's on him. Hey guys. <laughs> See what happens with this guy. Yeah, absolutely zero armaments. Okay, hell yeah. Hell yeah, you like to see it. Alright, what do we got? Where is that horny toad? Oh, it's the hero variant. Oh, hell yeah. What do we come with? Large lasers, burst fire ACs, LRMs. Oh, hell yeah, baby. Horny toad is the smallest, the greener... I'll have to read that one later. Hell yeah. Uh, what else can we got? Hammer hands. Not a bad mech. Actually, yeah, awful mech. Never mind. Grasshopper. Uh, no crazy good variants that I've seen so far. It's not clan, but it'll do. Shadowhawk 2D. Grasshopper stalker. I think we might take the stalker just to sell it. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to take the soccer just so we can sell. Actually, let me sell this. Oh, Wolverine with the headshot. Yeah, we're taking that one. And I think we're going to borrow this javelin and get out of here. Ooh, that sweet, sweet salvage. And we got one mission left for the contract. One Bad mission news, left. Commander. Extreme Infiltration mission. Means you'll be dealing with limited visibility and compromised <sighs> sensors on this mission. Right. It's infiltration. We need to go small, 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 small lance. What I did last time with the infiltration, you should be able to take one mech in there. That should be all you need for an infiltration. Because we're just infiltrating, right? So. Allocate negotiation points. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, why did I do salvage? I'm an idiot. Eh, whatever. We're going to run with it. So, infiltration. Should be able to drop in. Should be able to get in there, spot everything really quickly. Nobody shoots at me, and then we're out. But we will Commander, see what I happens. I dropped you right on the front line with hostile forces. Our client is requesting a meet at a small border checkpoint back up ahead raising. regarding our assignment here. Battle light link on your established. Stay away from enemy units to remain undetected. Light mechs are much harder to detect. Command your lungs to hold fire as any attack will immediately raise an alarm. I'm trying to get to this nav point Our as quick as possible so we get in and out. As a performance bonus. If yeah, we're not we we're not doing bonus. Yeah. Present themselves as targets of opportunity, I'm not doing any of the crazy bonuses them. for combat. I'm just trying to get in and get out as soon as possible. Of some valuable supplies that our employer would like Wait, liberated. Our client would like us to scout the Op Four's battle mech forces while we're in the field. Scouting the battle mechs. Attempt to sensor lock each mech you come across without alerting them to your position. Now we need to get around here. We got a turret. So this is kind of where the sneaky stuff comes in. But once again, we're in a giant fucking battle mech, and I don't see myself being sneaky at all. I'm still kind of learning the, uh, learning how this works. I need to get around these guys, in between them. It looks like we'll be able to do that. We got the stealth suit. As long as 
I stay a couple hundred meters away from all this stuff, we should be fine. I think you would just send infantry on this, but, you know, whatever. Target acquired. There is a turret right there. I gotta find all their battle mechs and lock on to them, so we're gonna attempt that. Oh! Target acquired. Try to lock on to this guy. Primary acquire enemy assets. What enemy assets? Oh, we gotta get the assets. That's not good. Detection warning. Get out of sight of that thing. Okay, so the turret can see us if we don't play this right. Let's see how it can detect us. I'm just gonna stop moving and power Shut down. down. I got one. I think I'm out of here. Um, I think we're gonna we're gonna. I think for time we're just gonna evac on that one and get out of here. We got the enemy assets. Only two more enemy mechs we had to spot, but I'm out of here. Good God. Okay. So I kind of see how that works. I kind of see how that works. Okay. On that note, everybody, we had a pretty good run. Good little mix up. We found the horny toad. Totally forgot about this mech in the entire game uh, with yet another mech lab. But anyway, it was really fun, and I'm glad you stuck around. So, if you did stick around, feel free to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, right swipe, super like, as always, and uh, let me know if you uh, want to see anything different, mech warrior, or anything like that, in the comments, because I'm always trolling, I'm always looking, I'm always, I'm always watching. Anyway, I'll see you guys around, and uh, as usual, have a good one, and I will see you in the next video.